It is a fabulous night for Jane. Her new column, People and Their Pets, is going to be a big smash. This is following her career as the editor of uh, International Pet Scene for nine years, pet, nine pup, pet books, which she was very successful at. Uh, another nine paying job. Okay, I love you, Jane. Uh, Jane, congratulations. I know I read your first uh, article, it was great, and I think you're going to be very successful. It's great. Jane, I love you, you're the best, and you still look like the beautiful Playboy Bunny you used to be. Not a bit different. You're the best, you're sexy, beautiful, generous, everything. I love you. Jane Pontarelli, we love, to, to know her is to love her. I support her in anything she does. She's a beautiful woman, and she's also a beautiful Playboy Bunny, if you didn't know that. Thank you so much for the wonderful invitation. What a beautiful friends and people here. And I know she will have the greatest success because she's such an amazing, amazing person. And I appreciate very much to be here. Thank you. Bigger and better, bigger and better every year for Jane. That's, that's what I've seen in my, in my short time knowing Jane. Jane, we love you crazy lady. And congratulations on your column. And we love Lulu. Oh, Jane is the most wonderful, exciting woman. She has more excitement than anyone that I know, more energy. Uh, she's filled with love. She lights up a room. Yay. Yay for Jane. Hi, Jane. I've known you for, what, 20 years? You are one of the most philanthropic and wonderful people, whether it's Play for Pink or anything for your lovely pets. We just love you. You do so much for the community. Congratulations. Jane, all I can say is you're a force of nature. Hi, Hi Jane. I'm so happy that you are starting your own column. I'm sure it's going to be such a success. You have so many friends and admirers who want to hear what you have to share with us. Looking forward to hearing your column in Resident Magazine. Jane is a very old friend of mine. I'm not, I don't go back to the Playboy days, but I, I know her probably 25 years, and she's one of my favorite people. Jane is one of the most dynamic people I've ever met in my life, whether she be in New York, whether she be in Palm Beach, whether she be in LA. She just has a gracious way of being, and she makes you feel at home. And it's a pleasure, whatever she does, I'm always happy to be there. Hi. I love Jane Pontarelli. I've known Jane for maybe four years. I met her at a book signing, and after that, just absolutely fell in love. She's the best realtor in the Hamptons of New York, and a dear, dear friend. And I want to congratulate her for her fabulous article about animals, dogs, because I love them too. And I intend to do uh, be in one of her articles for them. So again, congratulations to Jane. There is anyone more fabulous than the Jane. She's, I think she needs that name, like the Jane. There's only the one Jane, and I love you, and you're fabulous, and congratulations. Congratulations, Jane. We always great job, love that you. You do a great column. You always talk about your little puppies and my little Lulu. All the best, sweetheart. Congratulations, love you. Jane Pontarelli is a New York institution. She is always full of life and love and sunshine, always looking to have a good time and always wants the best for her friends. I know Jane forever. Uh, I didn't know her when she was a Playboy Bunny, but she made sure I knew that. You also probably don't know she used to date Al Pacino. She gave him up for her fabulous husband, Joe, who I love and adore as well. And she's funny as hell. So this column is going to be a scream. Jane is a unique, wonderful, beautiful, very good friend, a terrific, terrific human being. We love Jane. She is a piece of work, really special. She's sweet and lovely and She's, I guess she's a really good salesperson, because you know what? She's like sporting this party tonight, isn't she now? Love you, Jane. Hi, Jane. I just want to say you are my favorite bunny and my favorite pupil. I love you. I wish you well. And I can't wait to read all your columns. 
Love you. Jane, we love you. You are my sister from another mister, although Michael hates when I say that. Thank you for doing the pet column. It is an honor to have you in Resident Magazine. We love you. We cherish you. Play for pink. We're thrilled. Come June. We're here to support you and love you. God bless. After hearing all of these things, what can I say? I'm so honored to be mini-me, and I'm going to take a bite out of Jane's ears. Congratulations, Jane. I can't think of a better person to, be, to have this column in Resident Magazine than Jane Ponterelli. I've known Jane for years, and for years I've known all of her Lulus. And Jane truly loves animals, and she loves people. So I think this column is going to be the perfect vehicle for her to raise awareness about animals, to raise awareness about her friends who love animals, and probably save a lot of animals' lives, a lot of dogs' lives along the way. And I'm just so proud of her.